What is popping, all my wonderful people of the world? It is your girl once again, Miss T with the T, and I'm back here to do another clothing haul. Today, I'm going to share with you five dresses that I got from Shein. They are mesh. They are totally see-through. I have some stuff to go underneath them. So if you're wanting to know about these dresses that I got from Shein, then I highly suggest you watch this video all right everybody so welcome or welcome back i'm your girl the one and only miss t with the t where i love to do clothing hauls food reviews mukbangs anything i can do to help you save a coin i am here to share with you guys so if you are not already in the loop please make sure you click on that subscribe button down below so you can stay in touch with me with all the tea that I like to give out on this channel. So all that said and done, I wanna share with you these dresses that I got from Shein. I have a total of five dresses. They are mesh, meaning they are like totally see-through material. And yes, they were all about four or $5. And I do have some items to go underneath them, but I think for the simplicity of this video, I am just going to rock this one piece here underneath. So yes, let me put this on and try on these five dresses because I don't want this to be too long. So I'm going to try on these five dresses and you let me know which one is your favorite and which one is your least favorite and all that good stuff in the comments down below and I will be sure to respond back. So all that said and done, let me go ahead and switch into the first outfit. Okay, so here we are with dress number one. This one is one of my favorites, however, it's not as long as I was thinking it was gonna be compared to the model. I must be a little bit taller than the model. Uh, when I walk in this, it goes up a little bit more as well. So that is the con about this. But like I said, I think this dress was like $4.50. So win-win situation. And yes, this is what she's looking like. Oh my goodness, there we go. Bam, bam, bam. It looks just right with this uh, one piece underneath. I'm loving it. However, because she keeps rising up, if I were to wear this, I think I would probably wear some black leggings with this and I would not dare try to sit down in this dress because like I said, it rises up. But this is one of my favorites. I like how it makes my body look curved in all the right places. So let me know what you think about dress number one. Is it a yay or a nay? And on to dress number two. All right, y'all, so here we are with dress number two. This will probably have to be in the least favorite category. I'm looking over here at my uh, mirror. So yes, A, I'm not a fan of the pattern. B, these arms do not go all the way down to where I like it about right here. So is it supposed to be like pushed up or down or, I'm not sure, but this one is even shorter than the first one. And like I said, I have to keep pulling these down. This might have to go into the Goodwill donation pile because this is my least favorite, but I will turn around Bam, bam. Yeah, I don't know. It's supposed to, it was supposed to be like a leopard print or something like that, but this is not, this is giving me a uh, grandma's pattern on her moo moo. And I'm not a fan of it. It's not, it's not zebra print or nothing. I don't know what this is. So yes, this is gonna have to go in the least favorite uh, donation to Goodwill pile because it's not my favorite. Let me know what you guys think. And this one is way shorter, not way shorter, but it is shorter than the first one. So I'm not really feeling this one. So let me know what you think about dress number two and let me try on the third dress. Okay, so here we are with dress number three. Uh, like I said, I'm wearing the same one piece underneath. I didn't know if the black one piece underneath this one will, will work, but it's okay, I'm not mad at it. So yeah, floral, I'm kind of in a love-hate relationship with floral. Sometimes I like it, sometimes I don't. When, it, when this was on the hanger, I didn't think I was gonna like it, but Trying it on, I am liking it. I'll probably give this about a seven or eight. And this one doesn't rise up when I walk. I think because the sides are ruched or however you say that. So it's got more of a, a hold on my hips or my thighs or whatever you wanna say. Yeah, I think it has a hold on my thighs so it's not going up like the other dresses were. So yes, this is gonna be a keeper. Let me know again which one is your favorite, which one is your least favorite. All these dresses are like $4.50. So, you know, it's not a loss if they didn't work out, whatever. But I don't think the dress number two is going to make it. So this is dress number three. Let me know yay or nay. And let me go on and try dress number four. 
Okay, guys, so here we are with dress number four out of five. This is going to have to go into the Goodwill pile as well. Uh, it's giving me, it's kind of rising up at the back. I guess I do got a little backside after all. So, yeah, this is going to be in the Goodwill pile. When I first took it out of the packaging, uh, it was cute or whatever, but this material is kind of itchy. It has like this, uh, I don't know if you guys can see it, like some glitter, some glitter mesh in between the, the mesh. So it's like two different types of mesh on here and it's really itchy. So I washed it before I tried it on. And yes, I'm not, I mean, it's a little bit too much for me. It might, it might work for somebody younger. I'm in my forties and uh, yeah, I don't, I don't like this. I mean, it's cool. I was thinking about maybe if I washed it and then it would get a little, you know, not as rough. Then I could wear this with some leggings and, you know, probably stepping out or something. But because it is way short. I don't even know if I want to turn around. I'm not going to turn around. I'll give you a half angle, but that's about it. But she ain't even going all the way down. This ain't even a, a dress. This is a shirt. So, yes, I don't know how to soften up this material. If I could soften it up, I would straight wear this with some leggings, like I said, maybe a heel and rock it like that. But this is not a dress. I don't know who said this was a dress, but this is not a dress. So anyways, let me know what you think about this. Um, or if you have any tips or tricks for me to soften up this material. And then, like I said, I can wear this with some leggings and, you know, ladies night or something like that. So with that said, let's go ahead and try on the last dress, number five. All right, everybody. So here is the last dress of the day. Love this dress. This will have to be my number one favorite dress. And then the black and white one will be have the black and white one. The first dress will have to be my second favorite. But yes, I still have on the same one piece and I tucked in the, the, uh, the straps. Yes, I tucked in the straps and, uh, yes, love this one. However, this was, uh, this took me a good five minutes to get all this string together. And it's, the string is so long. I had to wrap it around my body. And I tied it up. So, yes, it is the same one piece underneath. Love this one. Yes, I'm rocking Crocs with uh, with this dress. I've been rocking Crocs all week. But, yes, this is a, a definitely a 10 out of 10. I can wear this one out. So, for me, let me see. My first favorite is this one right here. This will have to be my second favorite. And dress number three will have this will be my third favorite. These are my three favorite dresses. These are the keepers right here. Now these other two, let me see, put these back. These two might have to go on down to uh, Goodwill Town because I don't see myself rocking these. So let me know again, what do you think about these dresses? Is it yay or nay? Are you liking them or hating them? I'm dying to know what you guys think. Yeah, and I want to, just putting on this dress makes me want to go somewhere. I have no idea where I'm going, but I want to go somewhere. <laughs> but with all that said and done, thank you guys for stopping by. And until next time, peace and love. Talk to you later. Bye.